Welcome to the wonderful world of catapults. Here's how to set up your own circus of flying cats in amazing different ways. Let's get started. Here are the four components of the catapult. Clockwise from the left are the launching body with pivot, the base, the cat, and the target plate. Begin by snapping the launching body's pivot into the base. Push down and release the launching arm about 10 times to promote consistency in the springs. Now it's time to attach the trigger plate. Slide the plate into place on the trigger arm. Push it back as far as it will go. Place your thumbs on either side of the plate and snap it into place. Now you can get your cat ready to launch. The first thing you need to do is set the cat. The trigger arm won't stay down if the cat's not there. Hold the cat firmly by the shoulders and press down. Sometimes the plate needs a little lift in the front to make the trigger arm click down into place. The next thing to do is set the adjustment. This red dial adjusts the release point. Notice how high the arm goes up by turning the dial. The green dial adjusts the spring tension, which is what makes your cat go the distance. You can pivot the catapult on its base to point it in exactly the right direction you want your launching cat to point. You may want to hold the base with your other hand to keep it steady. Here is a simple chain reaction. First, seat the cat. Drop the cat onto the target plate and launch the first cat. Fix the cat's landing position, then place the second catapult. Launch cat to catapult to trigger the second cat. Fix the second cat's landing position and place the bowl. Set off catapults and miss the bowl. Reposition the bowl. Replay and land in the bowl. Yay! The cats remain standing. Incredible! Here it is in slow motion. And here is a complex chain reaction. Ready to take off. Slow motion.